welcome to the next episode of Pokemon Reborn. Uh, last time out we managed to free the kids that were holed up in the Yuryu building by the despicable Dr. Connell. Um, crikey, look at the time we've been playing this. And so, uh, I forgot to mention it, when we fought him we had the option of saying yes or no to releasing Heather. If you say no, it's one of these little plot divergencies and you end up having to go to the top floor and fighting Solaris instead. Uh, I don't think it matters which one you fight, you're still in for a tough battle. Anyway, let's continue. There are all the kids congregated again. Uh, let's uh, talk with the head. Oh, let's talk to Kane. Kane's always good for a laugh. Hey, Heather, come on, say something. Anything. Tell me to shut up if you want. No. Let's talk to the boss. So, that door's still locked. Was there a key up there in that building somewhere? Ah, uh, yes. That's in case you did, you missed it. <laughs> the railnet is locked. Die laughing, use the railnet key. The door open. All right, are we still going to my sister's place in Chrysolia? I don't have anywhere else to go, so... Uh, hey, we should go quickly. Okay. Nostra isn't feeling very good. Nostra? Don't you mean you're not feeling well? You look pale. No, no, no. It's definitely Nostra. She says she's dizzy and tired. Uh-huh. Okay, then we need to hurry. We're going on ahead. Let's meet at the Railnet's exit. Okay, mm -hmm. here we go. Right, the Underground Railnet. Now, we've already had a, an encounter here. We had a, a Noibat, so I'm going to put on a Repel. Although there's a lot more Pokemon here now. It's much more diverse. So maybe in hindsight, I should not bother getting one earlier and waited till now, but never mind. Now I've kept um, Schnub in the team. I know he's dead. Uh, he's not going to be doing any battling. I just want to show you guys something. This guy is the only one with headbutt. Uh, so there's something we need to see here. Right, okay, so we're in the underground rail now. As you can see, there's all sorts of boulders and debris. So it's a labyrinth of tunnels and railway lines. We can actually interact with these and change the line of the tracks. We'll need to do that shortly. However, there's also these little indents in the wall. Yes, we will. We'll break it open and see what's in there. And there's several of these. And there's treasure within. A house key. Mm, what could that be for? We'll find out in a minute. Let's see if we can find any more little indents. There's another one. What's in this one? It's an iron ball. Well, I got a few of them from mining, so that's not really of any use to me. Apart from selling it. Quite the labyrinth. Right, where else? Ah, right, so this is blocking our way, this um, barrier. Um, but we will be able to get rid of it. I'll explain in a little while. To explore that side. Just make sure there's no goodies. Oh, I think I should have bought some more. Let's go and talk to the guys. A swift wing, eh? Okay. What do you think, Charlotte? This place is just one door after another, isn't it? So how do we get through this one? Huh? Um, um, I think I know. Would you like to share that information, Shelley? Oh, right. I think I've read about these. When the rail net was made, they didn't really want people wandering in and out of it. Kind of like we're tr what we're trying to do. Hee <laughs> hee. So they made gates like this one that would open for the trains, but not for people. But, but, I think um, it works on a digital signal. We don't necessarily have to drive the train itself, but I think it works if there's the front of a train on the same track that connects to here, but the tracks in this place are so disconnected. Basically, if you complete a track from a train to this place, it should open. I, um, I think so anyway. 
but the train has to be able to drive it, so no debris can be in the way or anything, so... So there's a little gauntlet of a challenge laid down. So basically what we have to do is find a train, link up a clear line of track all the way to this barrier and it will open. So first thing we have to do is find a train. A cherry berry on a rock in the underground rail net. I'm sure I'm missing one of these indents. Ah, oh, there's another one. What's in here? It's a corrupted Pokeball. Very interesting. I'll show you what to do with that in a minute. Nothing, nothing, nothing. Aha. Another little opening. Oh, TM! Oh, will it be Ice Beam or Flamethrower or Earthquake? It's infestation. Why do I bother? Okay, yes I do. I think I've been that way. Okay, so here's the train. So, at the moment, the train track leads to the right and there's all sorts of debris. So that's not a clear track. So what we need to do is go straight on. Goes left. But more debris. So, we can't go straight on, so we must go right. Doesn't go down, so I think we have to go up from here. I may be wrong, I can't remember. All right, that doesn't go that way, so let's go that way. Okay, so let's go straight on. And now, see the barrier? It just disappears. So that gives us a little area to explore to the left. Ah, oh, it's dark. Smash this rock, see what we can find. Aha! Who's this chappy down here, all on his own? Mm hmm? Who? You're... Have I been found? It's been so long! I thought I would die down here! Some time ago, I was walking with my girlfriend in Obsidia, and this huge vine just lashed up through the ground and pulled me down here. I thought I... Whoa! Thank you so much for finding me. I couldn't move past all this debris. But I have to find her. I don't have much strength, but I think I can get out of here. Thank you so much. Alrighty. So what we'll need to do is track this guy down. And there may be a reward attached. Now that's not a barrier. We can actually go underneath that one. Okay, so we go down. Wow. Being careful to avoid the woobats. <laughs> I'm about to hit one. Okay. What's in here? Aha! Just ahead of us is a little indent. Let's have a look in here. Aha! Another TM! It's Flash! Brilliant! Okay, who can learn Flash? I think. There it is. What have we got? You the ding 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 ding. Oh herb, learn some flash for me. Ah, get rid of cup for now. 
Okay. Let's put the lights on. Light it up, Flash! Ah. Right! Oh my goodness, we're surrounded by little Arons! <laughs> yes, please. Right, what we need to do... Oh, hang on, something else to get. A Dusk Stone. Goody gum drops. Right, what have we got? Who's up front? Do, 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 do. What can I do not to kill one of these things? I'm a bit powerful. I think I might knock one out. Maybe a faint attack. Hmm. Let's put Herb up front. Right, so what we can do, as an aside, is this pole here, or this pillar, Ooh, look at all those little Arons. Now again, the metal pole is tall and rickety. A Pokemon could probably shake it, so. Uh, headbutt it, yes please. Dink, nothing, right, we'll keep going. This is another one of these strange events, but there's lots of them, so I'm gonna call it a wild Pokemon. Um, I'll ha if I do catch one, I'll have to check to see if it's got a different, um, IED to my noi but if it's got the same ID I'll bin it. But I can't remember. It might have a different one because we're down in the depths. Come on, I'm a how many God dear. I think it's a it must be quite rare then. <laughs> Yay! Eventually. Right, that's how to get yourself a little add-on. I'll try and go, oh my gosh, he's 40, right? It might be all right. Um, 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 let's try, will the Giga Drain kill it? Oh, just try it. It's got sturdy, thank God. All right, let's try and catch this little mother. Uh, let's go for a dusk ball as we're in a cave. What? Um, try again then. Come on, you've got one HP left. Yay, got an hour on. Right, we'll have to just double check its um, location ID when we get back to a Poke Center. Steel and rock. Um, yeah, what the hell can we call an hour on? Um, 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 oh, we'll just call you Ronnie. Until I think of something better. Right, great. Okay, so that's basically what you can do on this side. So now we've got a possible encounter. I don't think I've missed anything. Whoops. Right, so what we need to do now is go back to the train. Whatever the hell it is. And try and link up. There he is, right, so now we have to try and link up to the right hand side. So I think we have no choice but to go in this way. I think now what we have to do is to get it go straight on. It has to go this way because there's debris there. I think we have to go up from here. There we go. Up from here. Round the bend. 
straight on. And uh, let's go for a cancel. Yay, we're through. You got it then, perfect. All right, die laughing, I'll be right behind you. Okay. Yo, the great outdoors, cool. Okay, oh, hang on. Heather's off. Oh, oh, um, okay, bye. And second she sees sunlight, she's gone. Right. Not like I wanted to help my friend or anything. Hey, I'm still gonna go after her, alright? Just until I can make sure she's safe. I'll catch up with you guys later. Bye, Kane. So we're all buggering off in different directions. See ya, princess! Anna's practically white. No, no, I'm fine. It's Nostra who's not feeling well. Promise. Right, well, then let's go to my place so Nostra can rest. Follow me, kids. She says kids, but isn't she only a few, a few years older than us? Hey, let's get going. All right, well, I'm not gonna actually follow them. I'm gonna whack another rappel on because we found a few items in there that need further investigation. So let me explain what, oh God, I've only got five left. All right, let's get back out of here. There's a few interesting little things we can do now. Ooh, that was close. <laughs> do, 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 do. Alrighty, first things first, let's go to this Pokey Center. And there's the young fella that we rescued. So let's talk to his girlfriend. You're the one that found my boyfriend. Oh goodness, I can't thank you enough. You saved his life, that's amazing. Hey, you're the one who found me. Thanks so much for getting me out of the rail net. I really thought I was gonna die down there. Man, look, I know it's not really anything, but appreciate it if you took this sticker from me. It's for the Obsidian Department Store. They think they're kind of rare, right? They certainly are. So we've got another Department Store sticker. That's pretty cool. All right, let's check out our little Aaron to see if he's got a different identity. Right, let's have a look at him. What's he like? Right, so sub rail night is his um, idea. Reasonable. And our Noibat was underground rail night. So that's a different ID. So therefore, that's a viable capture. So that's great. Okay, so what we need to do now, let's just chuck you in. You're dead. You were only an HM slave for now, just for that demo. So you can go back to sleep. Sleep forevermore. Right, okay. Now. Okay, what's next? Um, oh yes, let's go in this little building here. And talk to this guy. Hmm, the craftsmanship on these balls is somewhat cheap. Sorry to nitpick, I used to be a ball designer myself. So it irks me to see these factory made in Kalos balls not being quite up to snuff. Hmm, you say you found a corrupted ball? Where? What I tell you, it's not surprising. Actually, it can happen for a few reasons. A defect is one option. But if a ball is damaged and not maintained, it can cause data loss. Here, let me see it. Hmm, right. So, see this crack? It was probably dropped from a long way up or something. That doesn't matter. The problem is, if some debris gets through the exterior into the circuits, then it can distort the electric transmission and then, well, this happens. 
I might, it might not be possible to fix, but you're honestly better off just buying another bowl. Let's talk to him again. Hmm, you're determined to fix this bowl. It probably won't be usable no matter what. <coughs> there, is the chance that a Pokemon was inside at one point, but... Well, when inside Pokeballs, my force data of Pokemon is converted to a digital format, meaning the Pokemon itself can corrupt as well. Whatever, this originally was before, it's probably Missingo now. Missingo can't be caught or tamed, so there's no point to that. Are you sure you want to still to, to try and fix it? Yes, please. I see. I have an old diagnostic kit with me. Let me see if I can detect any lingering data in the ball. Hmm, the data corruption is already at 96%. This is probably useless, but let's see. What can we use? Ah, magnet powder. Now we found magnet powder in a uh, meteor base along the way, so we have that. That will be small enough to slip inside the crack, then there's a chance that can reboot the internal circuitry. It also might erase the circuitry, but we don't have a better option, given the conditions. It's a gamble. Alright, talk to him again. You brought magnet powder, I see. Well, I can't say I don't admire your commitment, but it's probably pointless. Anyway, let's see what we can do. The corruption is now at 98%. Are you prepared to defeat the Masingo inside? It would be problematic to let it free. Yeah, let's go for it. All right, if you're sure, let's do it this way. Magnet powder is in. It's going to juggle the circuits a bit. And with any luck, there will be a second where the ball forgets that it's broken. Either that or the data will be deleted entirely. So here we go. The corruption has reached 99%. We're probably too late anyway. There it is. Woohoo! It's... Out. The Pokemon survived! But there's less than a 1% chance that it could have. Rah! Hmm, this Routes must be very brave to hang on through the corruption. Routes are known to be very loyal Pokemon, so perhaps it had faith that its trainer would release it before it expired. But if the corruption had reached 100%, Routes definitely would have been deleted. It seems we were just in time. And I doubted your judgement, my error entirely. Apologies! Well, there's no point telling what become of its previous trainer. And even this ball is unusable. I think it's safe to say Ralts belongs to you now. Yay! 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 <laughs> okay, we're going to call this little Ralts Astral, which is a anagram of a Ralts. So, lovely jubbly. Thank you very much. Okay, so that's how to get a Ralts. Next up, next up on our little journey. Uh, do I want to get... I'll oh, we'll carry on in a bit. Now then, the next one up. Oh, let's go and check out our um, daily lotto. Could we be really lucky and get an experience share? Yes, yes please. My lucky number, 62331. And we didn't get a match. I don't know why I bothered, forget it. Right, remember the house key we found in the underground rail net? Let's talk to this lady who lost the house key earlier on. Oh dear, oh dear, I lost the key to my home. I must have dropped it somewhere, but where? How did you drop it in a concealed wall, behind a concealed wall in the underground rail net? Huh, oh my God, that's it, you found it. Thank you so much. Hey, you might already know this, but I am the move relearner so I can pay you back for helping me. Normally I charge a heart scale, but since you found this for me, ah well, here, now how about this? Got a heart scale as well. Okay, now also, as if <laughs> we can now get the um, 
What do you call it? Lily pup. If you talk to this guy, but I don't really want one, so I just leave him there talking to it. Not at this stage of the game. So now we talk to this lady. She's the move relearner at your service. Like I said before, if you have a hard scale, I can definitely teach you Pokemon some old moves. Of course you have one. I got loads. Let's have a look. Let's just see what maybe Genghis can learn. Uh, well, nothing much particularly that I want, so <laughs> I'll leave it alone. Let's see who else. Morticia, can you learn anything? Eh, not especially. Right, okay. Bipolar! Yeah. How about quackers? Nah. <laughs> Not do very well. Gemini, surely. Oh, Stone Edge. There we go. I'll come back here with um, some other team members. Um, 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 let's get rid of Rock Smash for now. We'll have to teach it to someone else. Okay, there we go. Right, well, I'm going to knock it on the head there because we're quite a long way from where we should be. So next time out, we're going to uh, start off from the other side of the Underground Rail Net and continue to our little hideout in the countryside. Catch you guys later. Bye-bye.